Well, so let me just say this. I can speak for one group and one group only. I don't poll when I decide what to do about Afghanistan or Iraq. I go there. I've been to Iraq and Afghanistan 57 times. I saw this coming a long time ago. Thank God President Trump had a conditions-based withdrawal. I miss him tonight. But if you ask the military, would you risk your life to go back in Afghanistan to get our people out, they would say yes. We may lose some people to do this, but the one thing we will never lose if we do this right is our honor. And who the hell is going to fight with us in the future? If we're not willing to fight for these people now, who's going to fight with us in the future? You can fight this war in our backyard or the enemy's backyard. I choose their backyard. You can fight it alone or with partners. And if you're going to have partners, you've got to have honorable actions toward those partners. So we have the military capability to open up Bagram. Let's open it. We have the ability to establish a perimeter around the airport that is safer. Let's do it. Let's do what the French and the Germans are doing, going out and getting our people and cancel the 31 August deadline. There's no way in hell we can get everybody out. Well said, Lindsay. I got to say, as well said.